गाइस दिस इज मालिंकी वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल वॉइस ऑफ मालिंकी टुडे वी विल टॉक अबाउट सेक्स डिटरमिनेशन इन मैमल्स एंड इफ यू आर न्यू इन माय चैनल प्लीज सब्सक्राइब माय चैनल एंड इफ यू लाइक माय वीडियो प्लीज डू लाइक कमेंट एंड शेयर माय वीडियो सो बोथ द मेल एंड फीमेल गोनाड्स डाइवर्ज फ्रॉम अ कॉमन प्रीकर्सर द बाइपोटेंशियल गोनाड ओके based on the xx or xy chromosomes the sex of a fetus is determined and the process is known as sex determination let's see the steps of sex determination the conversion of genital reach into the bipotential gonad requires asf1 wt1 lhx9 wnt4 sox9 fgf9 and gata four genes if the fetus has xx chromosomes just like that the ovary develops by the wnt4 rospo1 uh it should be rspo1 dax1 genes if the fetus has xy chromosomes the chest is develops by the sry and sox9 genes the ovary makes thecal cells and granulosa cells which together synthesize estrogen under the influence of estrogen the mullerian duct differentiates into the female reproductive tract and the female genitalia offspring develops the secondary sex characteristics of a female testis makes sertoli cells and leydig cells sertoli cells generate anti mullerian factor amf under the influence of sf1 gene leydig cells generate testosterone under the influence of sf1 gene amf or anti mullerian factor causes the mullerian duct to regress testosterone causes differentiation of the wolfian duct into the male internal genitalia the testosterone is converted into dihydrotestosterone dht which causes the morphogenesis of the penis and prostate gland so this is the overall picture this is the bipotential gonad these two blue color it has two wolfian ducts as well as two mullerian ducts now the fetus has xy chromosome so what will happen of course the mullerian ducts will be degenerated and wolfian ducts will stay there so wolfian ducts become epididymis and vas deferens and in case of xx when the fetus is xx what will happen so the wolfian ducts will be degenerated and the mullerian ducts will remain as it is and mullerian ducts become uterine tubes and uterus so this is all about today's lecture i hope you liked the lecture thank you for watching my video